the Amra. I feared the humans would not be able to protect the God Key on their own. Jean d'Arc may indeed be capable of becoming a holy knight. Yes, and this conflict surrounding Bahamut will surely resolve through her. No, we will be the ones to end it. She is merely an instrument. We've yet to identify the demon masterminds or their end objective, but that will soon come. What matters now is that we assert our control, as our kind should. We must reclaim the God Key. Saint Jean, holiest of maidens. You've served your king in war magnificently once again. As a reward, I shall grant you a territory of your own. What would you like? Barazo? Ruel? I'm grateful, sire, but I must humbly decline. Decline? Are you sure? I have no doubt, sire. There is, however, one request I would make instead. <sighs> Oh, you are right, my lady. What happened? You fainted by the statue, but we're not sure why. I'm pretty sure I know why. She drank a whole barrel. It's not helpful when you talk. I... I had a dream. About when I came out of my cocoon. Cocoon? I was sleeping there, growing inside it for who knows how long. Wake up. You are one of the most special beings in all of creation. I am special. You must fulfill your mission, my dear Amara. Do so faithfully, and your greatest wish will most certainly come true. She waits for you now, in the promised land of Helheim. Go to... Helheim. She is the key to your happiness. She is all you desire. Go to her. My mother. You said before that pendant helps you remember her, right? I'm sure you miss your family a great deal. <gasps> Hey now, no more disappearing. Where are you going? My father was calling for me when I fainted. Calm down. You want to see your dad, I can understand that. But it's not safe to go wandering around. What about her father? What are you talking about? Oh, nothing. We're just telling stories. You come here for a reason? The king wants to see you. At the steps of his throne. What? Anyone want to guess what this is about? How would I know? Maybe he's going to send us to the gallows after all. That's easy to joke about for a zombie since you're already dead. Uh, huh? Now what? That's my father! By the woman! Are you kidding? That's Joan d'Arc's lieutenant. Father! Can we talk before you cause a royal scene? Do you seriously think that big shot is your dad? If that's true, it's significant, for starters. It would mean he's not really a human. A demon in disguise? I'd buy that. No. Uh, he can't be a demon. Yeah, that'd be crazy. Make up your mind. I met him once before in the city of Whiter. I was close to giving up. Desperation is a powerful force. It can make a man stronger. Don't ever forget that. He inspired me when I needed it most. He's a proud and honorable knight. Povero Leone, Kaiser Lidvard, my kingdom is in your debt. For your heroics against the demon raiders, I confer on both of you the title of knight. Huh? Knighthood? For us? Your majesty. Thanks for the gesture, but that sounds like way uh, more We gratefully than... accept, uh, sire. Uh, 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 Hear ye! The ceremony of knighthood shall now commence! As king of this realm, I hereby appoint you both to the royal order of the Orleans Knights. You honor us too much, sire. 
Yeah, you shouldn't have. <laughs> At long last, I have fulfilled my oath. I'll never have to hunt bounties again. That's too bad, because you can't take off that bracelet. I mean, you can't even break it with a sword. What? Not unless you're in that drunk's presence. Who knows what tavern he's at? <gasps> Saint Jean, these are the courageous warriors who fought the demon invaders with us. I have no doubt they will make my Royal Orleans Knights even stronger. Most wise, your majesty. The Angel Michael! You have battled magnificently, O oh, valiant humans. You are serving the gods well. Of course. It is our honor to serve. As long as the God Key is on human ground, there will be more activity from the demons, and you must be well armed. Thank you. Huh? Huh? The Precious, a sword capable of both blessedness and malevolence. It can even slay a god. I bestow it onto you, Saint Sean. May you use its power righteously. I swear that I shall. Michael, and what about me? Yes, your good faith will be rewarded. Continue to serve us piously, and your endeavors will have the blessing of the gods. Serping woman. The king of Anate is the proxy for the gods. They should only be speaking to me. She rejected my offer for land, which would have gotten her out of my city. And now Michael openly humiliates me by giving her that holy sword instead. Oh, tell me, mother, please. Who is the most revered in the capital? Who did the people love more? You must be careful, my son. <laughs> Mother! There is a traitor in your midst. A viper who wants to take your life. Who wants to kill me? Who is it, Mother? You know the answer, son. Look! Jean Dark? This is a warning, a vision of what will very soon come to pass. Jeanne will come. She will strike you down and steal your kingdom for herself. I won't let her. I don't want to die. I won't allow it. 
I won't! I'm the king! It's not right! Stay put. How was that not clear? I'm sorry, it's just... You can finally see your father, and it's hard for you to pass that up. <sighs> Come on. Let's go. This isn't the way to our quarters. Yeah. Yeah, I know. If my information's right, then your old man should be up there. You won't be happy till you see him, right? Hmm. Then go up and do it already, would you? <laughs> Thank you, Father! I'll be damned. That's the first time she ever said my name. <laughs> well, she forgot the row, but, you know, baby steps. Hey, what are you doing? This isn't a group trip. If you think I'm going to miss this, you're insane. Yeah, fair point. Um, father? You're here, Amara. I'm glad. It's hard to believe you were a baby five years ago. Five years? Uh. <laughs> Sorry about that. My bad. Leone, from what I understand, you've saved her life more than once. I'm sure this was more than you bargained for. Thank you for keeping her safe. He had help. Amira, we need to talk now. It's high time you learn the truth about you and your mother. The gods of war have been wiped out? It doesn't appear to be the work of Azazel or his lord, but whoever did it... ...is the mastermind behind the theft of the key, obviously. Gabriel, what should we do? Instruct the humans to increase security in their capital. We must prevent the key girl from being abducted while we prepare for our next move. If Lucifer isn't behind this, who could it be? It's been a long time, Beelzebub. Azazel has failed you miserably. Demonkind cannot afford more blunders, Lucifer. A real pity. I'll just have to send someone else. No need. I will take over from here. Is that so? Do you object to that? No. Once I retrieve the girl, we will have both sides of the key. Then the remanifestation of Lord Satan can begin. As the angel said, Amara is remarkably special, born from a union between demon and god. Yeah, I've been wondering about that. So a demon and a god actually hooked up? Do their parts even line up right? Do they even have parts? So what does that make you? Uh, uh? I do know Amara, but I'm not her father. I am an ordinary human. It was five years ago. I was assigned as a bodyguard for an angel who needed assistance. Her name was Nicole, Amara, your mother. She had been cast out of heaven, forbidden to ever return to her kind. Despite this, she looked so happy, because she had you in her arms. As her guard, we faced relentless demon attacks, and we were exhausted. But seeing the two of you in our camp gave us the hope we needed to survive. But then... After you were kidnapped, Nicole left for the demon realm on her own, determined to get you back. 
She left this pendant with me, to keep safe. I was reassigned and continued fighting in other campaigns. For a time, I searched for Nicole on my own, but to no avail. And then, that day at the bridge. The pendant told me all I needed to know. You had grown, but there was no mistaking it. You were Nicole's daughter. Fascinating tale. So the demons kidnapped her as a baby and sped her growth so they wouldn't have to wait. That explains why she's so childish. I just thought she was weird. So what now? I was told over and over I could see her again. As soon as I took the key to Helheim... And now that you know the truth, you're right not to trust those words. Helheim is a demon stronghold. A god couldn't survive there. But if she's not there, where is she? Your pendant. Let me see it. I certainly didn't know her little keepsake could do that. That's it. Her true location. In the Valley of Prodigia. You know that place? No. If you let this be your guide, then you can reach your mother at last. Please, take it with you. Another compass. I won't break it this time. Your mother had a power that was unusual, even among gods. And I believe that's another reason the demons were after her. If it's possible to free you of the god key, then she's the one who can do it. It's settled. Of course I'll go. What? Seriously? That should mean she'll remove your tail. Oh, yeah! I think it's a great plan. Believe me, Amura, I would go with you if I could. Yes, I know that. Your soldiers need you here, I understand. I'm sorry. When you find her, be sure to thank her for the faith she had in me. No. I'm going to bring her back with me. So you can thank her in person. Sounds good. I didn't know you were such a softie. Yeah. Just the thought of finally getting rid of this tail. Oh, yeah. And you'll go with me, right, Father? Hell no. I'd rather jump at a damn fire. I wish I could. I bet your mom's a real looker. It'd be great to meet her at least once. But I've got other plans I just can't get out of. You sure? Yeah, I mean... It breaks my heart, but I got responsibilities. Well, too bad. <sighs> That's nice. Are you gonna tell Kaiser about this? He's back to being a fancy tin can now. He's got no reason to hang around with us anymore. <laughs> Guess that means the three of us will have to be your send-off party. Though I highly doubt we can sneak her out of here without some serious distraction. <laughs> underground water channels. Wapley's clever, I'll give him that. <sighs> I still can't believe that tiny little lie got me into all this crap. <sighs> but now it's finally over. Now get this tail off me. Oh no. It's with a wavy hand. Well, you did say you wanted to meet my mother, didn't you? Uh... Uh... The soldiers are in a frenzy. What's going on now? What? Who's there? Oh, it's you. Thank goodness. 